Thank you for renting the Chattanooga Rehab handset. Place your electrode pads starting with the two pin pad to begin with at the top of the leg, followed by the single pin pads on the lateral and medial side of the affected leg. Now connect the electrode wires to the electrode pads and channel one and channel two of the handset. Make sure that the ends click in and always make sure that the red lead is furthest from the heart. To begin your first session, take the handset and press the power button. We have come to the main menu, starting with common treatments. The first button to the right of the power button is the scroll down menu. The far right hand button is the enter button. To start with, press enter on common treatments. Scroll down to rehabilitation one, enter on disuse atrophy. You need to let the machine know which part of the body you are targeting. Scroll down until the quadriceps areas are blacked out and then press start. On the positive signs of channel one and two, turn up to a point that is comfortable. Your session will begin for 25 minutes. The intensity you can reach will get higher with each use. If for whatever reason any of the electrode cables become disconnected from the electrode gels, you will see this sign appear on the machine. If that happens, reconnect your electrode cable to your gels, press start, and then turn up the intensity again to the level that it was at before. If for whatever reason you want to go straight through to the workout phase for contractions and relaxation of the muscle groups and want to completely miss out the warm-up phase, if you see the icon with the radiator, if you just press the button with the positive sign on, that will turn off the warm-up phase and we'll go straight through to the workout phase. As you can see, the arrow has jumped straight to the workout phase. At the end of your treatment, turn off the machine with the power button and disconnect your electrodes. Make sure that you place your electrode pads on the word on as opposed to no due to the protective film that it has. This will maintain the longevity of your electrode pads for up to six weeks. When charging your Chattanooga Rehab unit, please make sure that no electrode cables are attached to the handset whilst charging. Place the adapter end in the far left port of the handset. Make sure that you hear an audible click to make sure that it's attached.